Hey, Red Edition, welcome and happy day. You know what, the camera adds apparently 10 to 15 pounds on people. So I was watching one of my shows the other day, which I rarely do, and I looked and I thought, hey, who's that fat guy? So I went out for pizza that same night and it kind of hit my little brain. A guy came up and said, this size of pizza has eight slices. And I said, you know what? I look overweight on camera, cut it into six. Hey, and it happened and look at me now. I'm a shadow of my former self. President Trump. You know, songwriters and singers now, because of all the online stuff that's going on, don't get paid anymore. And these are the people that all vote Democrat. They're all liberal goofs, for the most part. Not all, I get it, but mostly they are. And what does he do? He saves them. I mean, he passes a bill and, and he says, hey, I got to protect recording artists' livelihood and intellectual property with tax cuts, fair play, and licensing protections. I'm going to help all Americans. So he set out to do that. He's the hardest working president of our lifetime, and he still gets flack every second of every day. And here's the people of all people to save. Wow, it's a Hollywood people, but he did it. And now these guys are going to get paid for what they do, and people can't steal from them anymore. Of course, you can still steal, but now there's a consequence. Kind of neat. I've been asked by many of our viewers my view on 3D guns. Is it okay to make your own gun with a computer? Well, I wouldn't be able to figure it out, so I think I'm not part of that. But you know what? You can make your own beer. You can make your own wine. You can grow your own pot. You can build your own helicopter. I mean, so it doesn't really matter if you make your own gun. I, mean, I don't know. Personally, it's easier to you know, not have to be sober or high and fly in a helicopter. Like, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know that I have an opinion right now. I mean, bad guys are going to do bad things anyway. Um, good people don't do bad things. I mean, if they don't make it online, they're going to make it in their garage, I guess. And, and the real bad guys can if they're sophisticated enough to be a really good bad guy, they're not satisfied with that type of firearm, so they'll go get another one, a real one. And, and if they're kind of a junior guy, a junior thief, uh, they can't afford to buy a 3D printer anyway. So I think we're good. Okay, South Africa. South Africa, you need a gun in South Africa. 60 murders a day, over 20,000 a year. It, you know, it doesn't paint a great picture, does it? Is that a civilized society? Not so much. I mean, and now they're saying, the government is saying, the black majority government, we're going to take guns away from all you good guys. And it kind of sounds like they've been in Canada for a while having a visit. But, but, but that's just bad, bad stuff. I mean, how dare you do that? How you dare you even talk about that? It's going to promote more crime. I wrote all this down. It's so profound. I was worried I might not remember it. Here it comes. If the government cannot protect you, you have the right. I don't have to write this stuff down, do I? You have the right to protect yourself and your family by any means possible. Uh, the disarming of the citizenry will benefit criminals from promote crime. We all know that. All the people, the people with minds, the government people without minds, they don't know that. And it kind of makes me mad. A law-abiding citizen can be trusted with a rocket launcher, and no one will ever be hurt because of his possession of it. But if a violent felon, a bad guy, gets a hold of a rock, a stick, he's going to hurt somebody. It always comes back to that. Good and bad. I, I mean, these people just can't figure it out. You know why? I do. It's about control. All they want, the left, they want to control us. And the best way to control us is to make us scared to talk. You can't talk about hating anyone. You can't be, you know, you, if somebody's gay and you don't want to be a close to him or something, you can't say that. You can't say anything anymore, and it's wrong. You should have the right to express yourself, not in a hatey kind of way. We all get that, but you should have some rights, and that's what the left is all about. Guns, though, it's a vocal thing, and boom, 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 and, and, and it makes noise, and they want to take that away from us. Oh, I got more. I think I'll save more. <laughs> I'm worn out from all this nonsense that they put us through every day. But always remember this. We have the government that we don't want, and thank goodness we don't have the government that we pay for. Hey, good news. See ya.